Okay, welcome back guys. So, I get to use this thing. <clears throat> it is the Neely Med Sinus Rinse. So, I just went to see the ENT today because um, the dentist said I have a cyst in my right sinus cavity. Well, the ENT said that she's not so much worried about the cyst and she... I didn't even think to record it either, so I apologize about that. But she said, she referred to it as kind of like getting a test for COVID, except not quite as bad. So she used a really long, I'm talking like this long, um, metal rod with um, a light and a camera on the end of it. And um, so there's some irritation. I really wish I would have recorded it. It was whoops it was actually really cool to see <clears throat> so she showed me in this one and oh my god that hurt she actually went beyond my nose to show me um where there's irritation which is causing me to have nosebleeds and then on this side there's like it's right here but on the inside there's like a a bubble pocket or something that's like full of that's just an air pocket or something but apparently it's been there for a long time so she's worried about that and she also said that I have a deviated septum so instead of my nose going down straight it's going <clears throat> in the form of a C. So she said that's contributing to my not being able to breathe and uh, oh, what else does she say um, my face hurting and swelling and stuff and uh, it's possible that it could be affecting me getting migraines. Um, just because of how bad it is. So, I get to start using this stuff today. Two times a day. And she said it's kind of like, it will feel like I'm waterboarding myself. So you guys get to see me torture myself. Woohoo! Anyway, so I get to use this twice a day. I have to put, um, I have to use a Q-tip and put, um, Vaseline in my nose to like not all the way up in there, just down here at the bottom. And then inhale and do it twice for, uh, I guess, to like coat everything and um, give the irritated spots a chance to heal. And then after I do that for two weeks, I have to use, um, I wanna say it's Afrin which is just a topical steroid <clears throat> and still do this when I do that because um, apparently my nose needs a whole lot of moisture, but the topical um, steroid will dry my sinuses out and make me have more nosebleeds. So <laughs> that's fun. So I have to wait two weeks, give it a chance to heal before I start using that. And then <clears throat> I have an appointment on January 8th. Um, she showed me a CAT scan from a year ago um, done on my head where, <clears throat> excuse me, um, where either side right here, I guess it's sinus cavity or something on either side of my nose. I don't remember exactly what she said, but it's extremely um, inflamed and angry. Like there's a bunch of, um, I guess, mucus pockets that are not draining because they have nowhere to go. <clears throat> so um, I have to go back on January 8th and get a, cat, a, a new CAT scan because she wants to see if this first treatment helps it clear up so I can breathe better. But if not, then we have to do or discuss um, surgery options to fix the deviated septum. So it fixes my face and I can breathe normal. So yeah, I know I'm so totally putting this off because I don't want to. <sighs> okay. So I already put the little packet in there and I'll show you how I did that tomorrow. So I did use distilled water. Um, she said it has to be sterile water, but I mean, on the package, it said that distilled was fine. Oh, okay. And this bottle you have to replace every 90 days. 
<clears throat> Squeeze gently use warm solution. Crap. I didn't make it warm because it's in a freaking gallon jug. Oh well, we're gonna we're gonna try it cold and see what happens. <clears throat> okay, so they said I have to lean over the sink. And she doesn't know, <clears throat> so it's supposed to go up one nostril and out the other, so I have to keep my mouth open. Um, she doesn't know if it will, though, because of how um, deviated the septum is, so we're going to find out. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> oh my god, it's so bad. Oh, I felt like I was going to inhale water. It definitely... <coughs> ugh, it definitely did not come out this side. It, like, got all stuck up there and felt like it was going to go down my throat. <sighs> I guess I have to use half a bottle on each side. This is going to suck for the next four weeks. Oh my god. You know that feeling if you're swimming and you go underwater and you like accidentally get a bunch of water up your nose and then you try to breathe and it burns and it hurts really bad? <clears throat> that is exactly what this feels like. And it feels like it's getting stuck on this side because now I can't breathe out of that nostril at all. <clears throat> I haven't used that much though because it's not like coming back out. It's not going anywhere. If anybody has done this, if I'm doing this wrong, please comment and tell me. Because <clears throat> this sucks. <coughs> oh my god. I had to put so much in my nose before it would come out. Oh, I need toilet paper. That is awful. Oh, yeah, I'm apparently not supposed to be able to, uh, I'm not supposed to blow my nose at all either. If I can't breathe, I'm just supposed to use this again. Oh, okay. So I had to put, here's where it's at. It feels like I'm inhaling saline, guys. <coughs> oh, if you've never done this, don't ever do it. It's awful. <coughs> It's a very weird sensation having liquid go up your nose and then try to breathe through your mouth while blocking off your nose. Oh. Okay, now I'm done with this. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, I've almost got it halfway. Ugh. Yuck. I guess I should put a warning on the title that this might gross some people out. Ugh. Okay, a little bit more on this side. Oh, I feel like I'm just pushing water up to my braid. Oh. 
This is absolutely horrible. Okay, so I got halfway, kind of. Now I'm gonna do the other side, because I do have to get back to work. Oh my God, it's not going anywhere with this side. Can you see how much I'm squeezing the bottle? It's not going anywhere. Oh, horrible. This is the side where it's curved into the seat. Maybe, <coughs> maybe that's the issue. Oh, it's so gross. Okay, I'm literally touching the little straw thing in there and nothing's coming out. It's just all going up. Ugh. Yeah, she's definitely right about that. I can't get it to go over on this side. Ugh. Cleaning out my nose, baby. Oh, there's so much pressure in my head because it won't come out. Yeah, none of that is snot. That's all water coming out. It just like, oh, I feel like it goes all the way up behind my eyeball before it falls back out. Oh, I've got this far with it. Oh, oh my God. Oh, I feel like water is just going to be stuck in my head now. Okay. Stand up a little bit so you can see it. So I bleed all the way over. I never realized I had a deviated septum, but I've had nosebleeds since I was like five. I remember the first time I was in the bathtub and my mom came in there and told me it was time to get out. And I thought I just had water on my face. She started freaking out. I'm like, Mom, what's wrong? The whole bottom half of my face was covered in blood from a nosebleed. <clears throat> but I live in a small town, so they never thought to refer me to an ENT to see what the problem was. It is not going anywhere. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I could easily accidentally kill myself like this by like shooting this up in my nose and then trying to inhale through my nose and inhaling it. Oh. Oh, there's so much liquid stuck in my head. <clears throat> I don't know if you can tell, but there's so much liquid in my head now. It's like forcing its way out the other side and just little drips. Oh, it's so hard not to blow my nose right now. Oh my god. This makes me want to sneeze too. Okay, that's a little better. Squeeze it fast. It just comes back out, but that's apparently okay.
<laughs> okay, I got this far. I'm going to use the last little bit on this side. It definitely feels like <coughs> it's trying to go down my windpipe. Oh my god. Ugh. Ew, that was not coming out. I'm so sorry. That was so gross. Let's see if I can get the last little bit. <coughs> okay. Oh, so much water in my face. In my oh my god. Okay, <clears throat> so I got what I could out of it. That was absolutely horrible. Oh, I have to do it again later tonight. So I will do another video then and see if it's any better. Oh, thanks for watching, guys. If you want to watch the updates for this, the CAT scan results and stuff, don't forget to subscribe so you know whenever my next video comes out. Oh, I'll see you guys in a little bit.